feeling it's more like a function of society today, just the way that we've been. I mean, people have been bred to rely on the state uh, yeah. to sulk, to have a victim mindset, because they think that they'll get what they want by whining. But um, why did you lean more into let's go do some work, let's learn combat sports. If chess yeah. is not available you know, yeah. for me to compete in, I'm going to go do this instead. Like, Why not just sit around and pick your nose and cry? Yeah, I mean, I, I had a lot of important lessons for my dad in the, in the days I lived with him, but uh, one of the things he was very, very good at, he had a few uh, fundamental themes throughout our, our when we lived together throughout my childhood, and one of them was, was about excuses. So if I lost a chess game, for example, there was a there was a chess tournament. It was seven hours drive. We drove seven hours. We stayed up all night. I stayed up with him. I played chess in the morning. I lost. I only had two hours sleep. Mm -hmm. And when I lost, I said, oh, because I was tired. And my, and my dad made a very big point of saying, look, it doesn't matter if you were tired. Your excuse has fucking nothing to do with the, the win or the loss next to your name. You've lost now. No one's going to say he lost, but he was tired. They're going to say you lost. And, and this is the truth about excuses in general. Any excuse you can fabricate. Nobody gives a, nobody cares. The universe doesn't care. Did you win or did you lose? Life is binary. Did you survive or not? I, if you come at me and say, oh, I'm fat because X, Y, Z, the girl isn't in the club isn't going to be like, oh, well, he's out of shape, but it's okay because X, Y, Z. You're just fat. It's, it's binary. Life's binary. So you have to make a, a, a conscious decision. Excuses don't exist. They don't have any weight. They don't matter to anyone else. So why should they matter to you? And as soon as you realize that all that matters is the result and, and you have to be binary about your decisions, then you're going to start throwing all that crap away. And I understood that from a very, very young age. So even when I was a teenager in England and I decided I wanted to be successful, I didn't sit and go, I want to be successful, but I'm in a, I'm in a single room in a homeless hostel, single mother. Da, da, da. I just knew I wanted to be successful. People are either going to view me successful or not. They're not going to care about anything else. Mm. If, they don't, if they're not going to care, I didn't care. It didn't enter my mind at any point. I didn't let it cloud my vision, if that makes sense. It, it never entered my mind. This is my, yeah. situ this is my situation, this is my scenario, so I have to do what I can do, and that, that was it.